Welcome everybody out to the street, downtown street ministry, and I'd like to try to sing a song here, if we can. compared to the heat. It's not going to be nothing compared to hell uh, when you're down there burning for eternity, forever and ever and ever and ever. Uh, but I'm here to tell you there's a way of escape. There's a way out. His name is Jesus. But we're going to have uh, Brother Matthew come and preach for us today. Y'all be much in prayer for him on Facebook if you can pray, if you're living right, and just be much in prayer for him today. Bless you. be reading from Luke chapter 11 and starting in verse 33 it says no man when he hath lighted the candle putteth it, in a, putteth it in a secret place neither under a bushel but on a candlestick that they which come in may see the light thy, the light of thy body is the eye therefore when thy eye is single thy whole body is, is also full of light Yes. but when thine eye is evil my, thy body also full, is full of darkness take heed therefore that the light which is in thee, be not darkness. Thy Bless whole Lord. body therefore be full of light. Having no part dark, the whole shall be full of light. Eat, as when the bright shining of a candle doth give thee light. Bless the Lord. And I was just thinking about how we as Christians need to be light for this lost and dying world. That's right. Dying and going to hell. And they need somebody to show them a better way. And you know, the Lord will show them a better way, but He does it through us. That's right. And we've got to we've got to live holy, clean life to show them that there is a better way. Yes. And you know, there's people out here that say you don't have to live that way. You yeah, don't come have on. to live holy. You don't have to live clean. Yeah. But you know, we, I've I've had people tell me that since I've been in church. So yeah. Since I guess three or four years ago, people's told me that. Bless them, But you know what? There was something down in me that told me that I had to live that way if That's I wanted right. to make heaven my home or I wasn't going to make it. We've got to live holy and clean lives and be a light to the world. Bless and them, he, Again, He does that through us. You know, they uh, if they see us doing whatever, they're not going to want anything with what we've got to do. Bless we've got to be a light. And we've got to let our light so shine before men that they may see our good works. That's right. And or they may see our good works and glorify our Father which is in heaven. We've got to be a light for the lost and dying world, a holy and clean life. Bless but, you. Know, I mean that. I'm done now. That was just a short, but it, as long as the Lord's in it, it don't matter. That's how right. Long it was. That's right. Bless you. 
Amen. Good preaching. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father which is in heaven. We got to let our light shine. And there's a lot of people that call us judges and say we're judging this or judging that, but the Bible tells us to judge, a righteous judge. The Bible says to judge by the fruits, and that's what we're out here doing. We don't want no blood on our hands, but that's what we're out here doing. We're out here to be a light, to be an example, try to witness to some people, try to preach to some people, and try to get them in before it's too late. Dear Heavenly Father, Lord, we come unto you, Lord, once again, just to thank you for another day of life. Thank you for the preaching, Lord, for the brother that delivered the word. Lord, we just ask you, Lord, to help us, Lord, to be a, a light to the world, be an example to this world, Lord. And Lord, just help us to grow in the grace and the knowledge, Lord, each and every day that we live, Lord. Uh, uh, Lord, just to let you guide us, Lord. Nothing in ourselves, not to take a step, Lord, on our own, Lord, but just rely on you, Lord, each and every day that we live, Lord. Thank you for everything you bless us with, Lord. Bless the meetings there tomorrow. Bless the revival coming up over in Dank, Virginia, Lord. Just, Lord, get the lead guy and direct us each and every day. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.